you think it would be better on the so, corner like that? Yeah. I got my fish in the, I got my friend in the fish keeping hobby. And today I'm going to be helping him get a tank set up. Right now we're just going to clean some gravel. What I did was I took a knife and poked holes in the bottom of it. So the water would drain out. You cut a hole in the top and then boom, now you just let it drain. You might put the corner down in the drain. All right, now it should sell like that. Yeah, there you go. I'm going to put the water on it. But you can hold the water up above this if you want to. Alright, so now we're cleaning his old tank out. There you go, a little bit wet. I'm going to start off by just adding a coat of water around the sides. And you can't put soap in it either. You can put soap in it, you just got to let it drain it and clean it and everything. Yeah, that's why. On the snake tank, I used alcohol to get it clean, but I don't think I'm going to do that on this one. This is your fish tank. And no, you did not do straight alcohol. That's horrible for your snakes. It was 20% alcohol mixed with water. I also have a video about making that on my channel if you guys want to see that. Yeah, I'm so. What cup cleaner are you just cleaning? I think it was just a little bit dusty. If I'm gonna see who's here. There's no one here. I hate her things, Chase. Hmm? I hate her things. Probably stayed up too late. You're probably hallucinating. Well. I did I on the cold. <laughs> I turned all the heist it told me to. It's really cold right now. I know, it's really So how long is it going to be before you put fish in this? Probably this. Well, I need to know if I need to put warm water in it, just normal water. Well, you're a fish guy. I would recommend to let it set for two days before yeah. putting anything in it. But you know, you can do that to Start cleaning on the inside. Oh, what'd you guys have in this thing? I don't know. It's like, I just did they have sand in it? I'm pretty sure it's just for a turtle, to be honest. That's way too small for a turtle to too. Well, there's a, it, I know why there's not a turtle in it anymore. No, there's a baby, baby turtle. Like, it was just about half. Oh, well that makes more sense. But still. And then it got up to about that big and then they took it out and put it in the big pond. So did your grandma not do this to you or did you buy it? Grandma. She used to keep catfish. I've had catfish before. I know, like baby catfish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You want that much? It's all black too. It would have been cool though if this would have been white gravel. That way this here would pop out a little more. Yeah, maybe you should make a white one. Yeah, I just don't have very much white. So guys, oh, you might want to leave it on there so it'll I stay am. under. So guys, I've custom built this with my friend. This here is soon to be his birthday, so I took my 3D printer and printed it out for him. We'll put it in there. See, you can't even hardly see the stand. Well, oh, you can't hardly see it, but. I don't need that much of a hideout, but. Yeah. I expected it to be a little bit bigger, sorry. But what? I expected the core will be a little bit yeah. bigger. What? How long does that take to print? Like, what do you mean? That, what, the, how long do you think? What's well, printing? I think it said like two hours, something like that. So, yeah, guys, this goldfish tank's all done. Thank you guys for watching, and yes, the Super Bowl is on. And I will catch you all on the next one. It's been Pug Life. See y'all later.